Welcome to the science channel where we're going to test out things in the microwave that shouldn't be microwaved. Ow! This is an egg and this is my wife's microwave that I snuck out of the kitchen. I guess I'm gonna have to buy my wife a new microwave. Which one should we get, Mom? Which one? That one? Okay. Alright. So, are you... I don't have a knife. Ah! And we're going to microwave a 22 bird shot to see if we can make it go off. I didn't think this through. Go get the gas can. Okay, I want to chop one through before we put a hot dog in the microwave. Ninja! I still got it, didn't I? Alright, let's put it in the microwave. Let's see if we can burn this into a crisp so much that it turns into fire. 10 minutes. Look at that. My goodness. I think it's gonna go on fire any minute. It's been six minutes and a little over six minutes. We're gonna open it up. I think we're gonna move on to the next. It is not wanting to catch fire. I think my ammunition will catch on fire though. Yeah, take a look at that. That's just nasty. Let's feed that to my children. Here you go. The raccoons will eat good tonight. Okay, I think that's the only way to eat hot dough. Who doesn't like some very burnt popcorn? Ah, this is lame. Let's go for this. Let's go, uh, let's just start it off with four minutes. Oh, we got fire, boys. Oh! Oh, we got fire! Alright, uh, I didn't sink this through. Go get the gas can. <laughs> Gourmet chips. Sizzling on the plate still and eat it with a fork. Be careful, it's hot. <laughs> Welcome to the science channel where we're going to test out things in the microwave that shouldn't be microwaved. Ow! I got a bird shot 22 here. 22 cartridge, and I got a hot dog. Can we make a gun out of a hot dog and a 22 bird shot? Let's find out by sticking this into the end of the hot dog. So we just got the bird shot sticking out, and then we're gonna put it in the microwave and see if it goes off. Got the hot dog in there. We got it set at 10 minutes. It's been about five minutes, so we're gonna unplug it and go check it out. The hot dog didn't work, so we're going to put the 22 bird shot into Doritos. Maybe we can turn a Dorito gun. Yeah, Dorito gun. Yeah, I like that. So we're gonna drop it in there and put it in the microwave. I'm sure this should work. And go plug it in. <laughs> so I guess ammunition doesn't go off if you just put it in the microwave. I do not try this at home ever. That's why we're not at home. We're at another guy's home. We reviewed the footage and it does show that the cartridge did explode and I'm gonna try to find the shell. Oh, here's the end of it. Check it out, Ugh. eggs. There it is, it did explode. So this is what happens when it's not in, in a receiver uh, in, in the bore of a gun. The cartridge, they just they explode and it, they're, they're not that deadly. They just mostly explode. But that's what I was trying to uh, figure out if I can make a bullet explode in the microwave. Now let's try a 4570. <laughs> Next time your kids are hungry and they're like, Mom, I want a hard boiled egg. As a mom, you're like, ah, oh, you know, it's so hard to hard boil an egg. Hard to hard boil an egg. <laughs> anyway, and then you go, you know what? I saw this crazy guy on YouTube and he hard boiled an egg in the microwave and it was actually pretty good. So.
Let's give it four minutes and 30 seconds. guys we did it we exploded an egg in the microwave can you explode an egg in the microwave yes can you hard boil an egg in the microwave yes but your kids shouldn't eat it that is science guys science why does an egg explode in the microwave well it's because of all the electric i grew up amish i have no idea mm. We got the tannerite in a cup. We're gonna put it in here and we're going to see what happens. Let's see if this is a good idea, boys. I, yeah, okay. Start it. A couple minutes. Let's go. Evidently, the microwave doesn't make the tannerite go off by itself. And I obviously knew that, but I just wanted to try it. Um, just kidding, there's no cord back there. Uh, we didn't want to run a cord a couple hundred yards down on the other side of the pond. So I'm just gonna shoot the microwave with Tannerite in it with my six millimeter Creedmoor. And this is gonna be great because um, who doesn't like shooting guns and making things explode? Before we blow up the microwave with Tannerite, I just wanted to show you guys the new addition to my family. And my family's all standing around me right now. But yeah, this is the newest edition. 12 gates are going to be making a video on this. But that's not what this is about. Actually, I wanted to tell you guys, this video is sponsored by Cabela's. If you see the link down below in the description, click on that link. You can get stuff off for up to 50%. 50% off, 20% um, off, 10% off. And if you buy something that, from there, I get a little bit of percentage. So um, yeah, just support the channel that in that way if you want. If you need something from Cabela's, just head on over and click the link down below. Um, so thank you guys, and thank you to Cabela's for sponsoring this video. I wanted to thank all of you guys for subscribing, for commenting, for all you do, for the, all the merch you're buying. I really appreciate it. And uh, I actually just received my 100,000 subscriber play button, and uh, I, I really appreciate that. It means a lot to me. Let's get back into the video, and let's blow up that microwave. Never tried this at home. Uh, but this, this, all these stunts were done by a trained professional. I got my GED in AMISH University. I'm gonna have to buy my wife a new microwave. Pick up all these pieces. But take a look at this. That's where it was sitting. And that's where it is not sitting anymore. The discharge capacitor. This is the capacitor. Ooh. The Lux capacitor. I might have to go back to the future. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. And uh, I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to watch my other videos. Because if you like this, you might like my other ones. But I'm going to do all kinds of stuff on this channel. So if you haven't already, support the channel. Buy yourself some merch. Go watch my other videos. They're not that interesting. But watch them anyway. For me. Thank you. And um, peace out. Did I just dab? No, I didn't.